Hello friends, today we will learn about bird reproduction and life cycle. See, this peacock is dancing here. It looks so beautiful. You know, birds sit near each other and sing or dance to attract one another. You are sitting here in the park. Look at these birds. The male boar bird builds a boar for mating and decorates it with sticks and brightly colored objects in an attempt to attract a female. If the female approves boar, she enters it. After successful mating, the male bird puts his sperm from cloaca into the female bird to fertilize the eggs. Then, the sperm will travel to the female's eggs through their cloacal opening. The female flies away after mating, and male boa birds have no role in parental care. However, some male birds, like chickadees, downy woodpeckers, and nuthatches, help their partners. Later on, the female lays her eggs in a nest that she builds in a tree well above the ground. The eggs are oval-shaped and usually white or brownish in color. The female bird incubates the eggs by sitting on them for approximately two weeks straight. This is to keep them safe and warm from predators like hawks, raccoons, skunks, snakes, or rats. Look, there is a tiny hole in the egg and it's shaking. A baby bird is coming out. When the chicks hatch out of their eggs, they are known as the hatchlings. The broken eggshells are dropped out of the nest by the mother to keep the nest clean. After two to three days, the hatchlings grow a bit and the mother works hard to feed them. This is the nestling stage, where the bird is not fully developed. Nestlings spend time in the nest, learning to eat, moving their wings, and developing social skills. Look at this diagram of a bird's wing. They give the birds the ability to fly, creating lift. Once flight feathers have developed, birds reach the fledgling stage with much maternal encouragement. They jump over the branches around the nest. The bird has become a juvenile. The juvenile bird slowly learns to collect food and fly by observing their mother. See, it has grown into a sub-adult. When the birds become 14 to 15 days old or older, they leave the nest. The sub-adult birds look a little bit different than their parents. After a few days, they become adult birds, reach sexual maturity, and are capable of reproducing. You have prepared a chart. Can you show it to your friends? The stages are egg, hatchling, nestling, fledgling, juvenile, subadult, and the adult. You can use it for your studies. Now you know a lot about the topic. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye-bye.